Okay. Mm-hmm. See that? That's a healthy tissue on that side. You know, now we're to a healthy tissue. Wow. To me, it felt like a really, really deep yes. pocket. <laughs> oh, yes. Just looks like it, it almost looks like a hard, mm-hmm. squished rubber ball. Look where it's still up here, and still part of it. So. Mm-hmm. Did you feel that? No, I was just trying to adjust over here. Because sometimes on the deeper part, you might still feel it. So is that all scar tissue, or is the cyst enveloped in that? Oh, the cyst. you see that? Yep. I'll yep. show you. And that's why we want to go to healthy tissue, because this is how typically the cyst is. You see this? Yeah. But look, here is the cyst. Here, I'll show you. That's scar tissue. Wow. You see that? Yeah. And then you find the cyst here too. You see that? Mm-hmm. You see? That's oh, yeah. here. So you can't tell. Normally, we dissect all the way down to this layer. Mm-hmm. You see? To this layer and clean everything around it and take it. But our, when it's been ruptured and have trouble with it before, we don't do that because then you're going to cut into the cyst. So we just go around it. So now we can tell, we can't tell 100%, I need more better time. Um, you could tell, you know, like almost you had everything out. And see when you look, everything looks healthy. No scar tissue. You know, mm-hmm. and we just have to close this now. Wow. And what size was that? There probably was a lot of scar tissue because the last person who did said, I'm really going to debris the heck out of it to get it to heal and yeah. to get the intention. Yeah, but maybe that was not the right thing to do. <laughs> this is about 4.3 centimeters. And I need some vital. 3L or 4L rifle. You see, like this, I don't like. I might just get a little bit like that and just give me a 4 proline. Whether there is something, because if you have a wall of the cyst, it can build up again. I mean, hopefully 